So we've been uh, very technical. We've gotten into to, to a lot of things that, that uh, uh, are pretty, pretty deep in the weeds here. Um, so I thought it would be good to, in, in the middle of these presentations, um, make it a little bit more fun. So I invited somebody who's pro probably as probably the least technical person on this panel, and that, that is Robert Reyes. Robert is the head of Startup Circle, and, and as in that role, he is meeting with and, and learning about every uh, new startup in San Diego and what they're doing and the cool technologies. And so Robert's up here to introduce us to 20 startups that we should know about, either because they may have a good impact on, on government and politics, or, or just because they're really cool. <laughs> so, Robert? So, I guess I'm the, the less technical and the fun guy. So, what I'm here to talk to you about, actually what, I, what we're doing is we're actually funding some of this company. So, I'm more in the funding side, also in supporting some of these companies to succeed. So, I want to here talk to you about rubber bands. Have you guys seen this rubber bands? I have a little bracelet on. It's about entrepreneurship. If you have a kid, you'll understand someone created this thing to actually do bracelets. Um, and all these people I'm here to show you is that we are early enough, most of these companies are in the software space. The first one that I saw was Portable Genomics, French company. They're actually taking your genome and actually taking it an Apple kind of uh, iTunes model and getting you, being able to actually see what's going on with your genome and being able to do something about it. The last one was Real Qualify and what she's doing, she's actually taking big data and making sense of that in the sense of your marketing and doing SEO. And the first two companies were both actually, one was picked for us to be funded and they did not take our deal. The second one was funded by us. This one is not a technical um, startup, it's Hometown Farms. They're creating a farm that's actually bringing an organic farming in a retail environment in cities. They're opening their first location in Vista. We funded this company as well. Uh, a number of, of uh, Ted Wade, a number of people in town have funded what they're doing. They are changing the way we're actually bringing food into cities. So you gotta check it out. E Financial Communications, Sandeep, was funded by us. Uh, he's going out to the Bay Area. He's changing the way uh, when you look at um, really how banks deliver information in a uh, compliance way. He's doing it all in a software uh, way that you don't have to hire new IT departments. So they're changing that environment. Brightscope, huge company. They've done amazing things in town. Just be aware of them. Uh, Mike Alpert is doing amazing things. They changed 401k ratings on how actually people rate their 401k. So you got to look at what they're doing. Amazing. Mitch Thor, entrepreneur in town, been around a while. He's just amazing. He created a company called ActiveNetwork.com, sold for hundreds of millions of dollars. Bomb.com is actually taking uh, people that haven't met each other yet and create a platform behind that. And all started through actually claiming your license plate. So check out what they're doing. Their platform is amazing. Give a like. Uh, I've got to give a shout out to Ben. He's just really revolutionizing the way you can give. And what he's in his platform is that he's optimized the way you can give, uh, minimize the fees and the hassles of actually doing your tax reporting as one benefit, that they kind of organize that for you. So again, that's another one that we actually invited and almost funded. Sorry we didn't fund you, guy. Uh, Inventive Communications, what they're doing, another French company uh, that came into San Diego, and all these companies are mainly based here in San Diego. <laughs> what they're doing is voice activation and through your hand, actually controlling your television and a number of different electronics in your home. We funded that company as well, and they're actually right now in the Bay Area. Pit Wireless, we also looked at it for funding. What they're doing is they're bringing wireless and hardware into understanding how your, your pets actually behave and looking for health signs to see if actually you can manage those. So Pet Wireless, they're definitely introducing technology into that space. Proceva, uh, what Elizabeth's doing is she's looking at the really the funding uh, bringing analytics and matching big funds and bringing data into how those dollars are actually impacting their outcome they're looking for. And it's unbelievable what she's done. Uh, we offer a deal for her to actually get funded and move to the Bay Area and she turned it down because she raised a pretty good amount of money already in town. So amazing company as well. Rainforest, we did fund this company. They're in the Bay Area today. And what they're doing, they create a marketplace for athletes and uh, brands to actually engage and find the right audience to actually influence. Very unique in this software. Santic is a biotech uh, focused company that, well, technology company that helps the pharmaceutical and biotech industry to change behavior through texting. 
uh, compliance in your, your actual, how you comply with treatments and medication regimens. They're doing something very unique and actually not just a simple text, it's very much has a big impact into how they actually change the behavior. Tip Network, we funded this company, also Santec as well. Tip Network is changing how restaurants actually account for tips. You will not believe how antiquated that is. They're bringing software into managing and documenting. Currently, tips are only done in cash by restaurants. It's unbelievable. Views, uh, this is an Israeli company that moved to San Diego. We also fund it. Uh, and what they're doing, they're inverting the way you do search. So normally, you go online on Google and you ask a question, and then hopefully you get all this random stuff that comes in. With views, what they're doing is that you're pinging the network, and the network answers back only on the relevant people that actually that question applies to. So if you have a question about this location, only, the, only that question will come to the people in this room. Very unique, very interesting. Send Havier, what they're doing is that they're monitoring driving through their software with your phone without, burn, without uh, burning down your battery. And uh, we offer them a deal that didn't take it. And uh, it's tracking how you brake, your speed, everything with your phone, not burning your battery, and tracking that information and telling you about it. Hawk Analytics this is a Temecula company. We're looking at them pretty hard. What they're doing, they're taking raw data from cell phones when there's missing people and trying to triangulate through that data analysis to find missing people they're working already with. Texas Rangers with a number of different people, amazing. Now I have a fun one, soccer league, whoever likes soccer or football as I call it. This uh, uh, entrepreneur, Miguel, was the first Mexican startup to be sold to Time Warner in Mexico. The only one actually experienced that for millions of dollars. They picked San Diego to create the first destination for soccer-centric only um, uh, you know, stories and, and information. So we're looking at them, want to fund them. And of course, Fab Lab, if no one's heard about Fab Lab, it's an MIT initiative. Uh, Katie's ru running that, and it's a hardware type of activity. And we're really excited to see what they can do with hardware and software together. So with that, that's me. I know that was fun, <laughs> but uh, Again, thank you, Ben, for putting this together. And if you have more questions about what we do and, and the companies, we'd be more than happy to share with you guys. Thank you.